Okay, my name is Clippy She, owner of Poster Magazine. We're here for the Artists of Model Showcase that we're doing at Epic Bar tonight. Um, I'm here with the lovely Kinsey. Uh, matter of fact, uh, since we finally meeting for the first time um, outside of social media, can you just give us a little bit about yourself and tell people what's going on with you? Well, I'm Kinsey, and I am a singer. I've been singing for 12 years, uh, performing for two. I just finished my first CD. And it's out March 8th. That's actually my CD release party here at Epic. So that's gonna be really fun. And I have three singles out on Google Play, Spotify, and iTunes. And one of, well, they're called <laughs> Lift Off Remastered, Man Eater, and Forget Me. Okay, okay. So I know you see mention something, you know, I you know, I probably on social media and I know you kinda of do the modeling thing, stuff like that. So, you know, what kind of made you get into do the modeling? that nature and for those that don't know uh, since this is a post magazine event though uh, we looking for post models you know kind of tell people what's going on you know especially females well I didn't know I was a model until you told me I was a model and then you had belief in me I was like hey I can't really be a model so that's what happened so I mean you know some people might think that, you know not take you serious enough so how very serious do you take both crafts, though, because I mean, you know, is this, is this a hobby or, you know, is it something that you do? I know music is, you know, is the baby, you know that. So, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, kind of, I guess for people that are trying to get into the business and stuff like that, male and female, you know, let them know what's, you know, what, what they need to do to try to juggle both. Well, it's a hard question. I mean, if you don't have a passion for it, then you're not going to do it. spoke earlier and you said you had just uh you just did a fashion show and things of that nature though. so I mean you know in Houston so how did how was that what you know and things of that nature you know when you do the fashion shows you know as far as the how, how did it go you know what is the, the pros and cons to it I mean versus trying to get ready to get on stage and trying to get ready you know changing in and out road jokes and stuff like that though. Is it, do you think it's more pressure or, or 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 is it you know when you get out there you can you know need a woosah moment and things that well, modeling is definitely more pressure because everybody's looking at you walk, and that is pressure. But on stage, I'm like, hey, I could forget the words, but they don't know, so it's just different. But if you trip and fall in front of everybody, they're gonna see you. So it's kind of, it is pressure a lot of pressure. So, so what big things did you have going on? I know it's a new year and things of that nature. So you know, besides the singles. Um, the release party, well, you know, what, what is the big things that you have going on? The tours lined up and the future fashion shows, uh, what's going on? I do have some tours lined up and we don't know all the details yet, but it should be happening in May, somewhere around there and it's going to be, it's going to be great. I mean, everything is, it's just falling into place this year. It's gonna happen eventually. Now I know you say you. Uh, I hate to keep going reference back to Houston. You know, you know that's where you're from. But I know you just recently went down there and you was in a contest, uh, singing for uh, Matthew Knowles, Beyonce. It's kind of you know for the experience. You know, how do you think that was for you though? Know, and did, did you think it kind of did it boost the, the confidence level as an artist that you know you can go ahead and do some people sing you, or it's like well. Maybe I should continue to do what I want to do for independence. Did not sign anybody. Oh, that definitely boosted my confidence because he said I had an amazing voice. He was spot on with all of the different feedback he gave to all the artists. So I mean, for him to say I had an amazing voice, I was like, whoa! And so then I was like, oh, I really can't sing, so nobody's gonna stop me now. I'm really going to the top. I just have to, you know, fix my image and stuff like that. But once I do that, I'm going. Okay. Now, as far as my people might not know what they mean, you know what I'm saying, when you, when you get things like Im fixed images and stuff, because you know, it's a lot of females out here, that, you know, they buy these, you know, they body parts, you know, face parts and everything. Like, it's just really sad. You know, so so for somebody that's it's all natural, things of that nature, though, you know, do you feel, uh, as far as people might say, well, I don't think that might belong to her or, or, or you know, you know how you know, the jealousy and things that are not females do with the candidates and stuff like that. How, how to do, I mean, do you experience that? And, and when you experience those things, what do you do to try to, 
you know, not you know, still man. I experience it all the time. I don't really have a lot of female fans because they're just not fans of me. But I mean, I just go on and do what I do, anyways. I mean, it doesn't affect me. I just uh, do it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Now, far as uh, social media links and things of that nature, where can we find you? You can find me on Facebook under Kenzie Kellerman. And then you can find me on Instagram, Kenzie underscore singer, and Twitter is Kenzie, Kenzie underscore singer 14. And then I have a website, it's Kenzie.Banzoogle.com. And you can buy all my merchandise there, and we'll even sell the CDs there. And it's awesome. Go check it out. Okay, now once again, you know, you said you have a... Uh, see the release party here, so you know what I'm saying, you know, kind of let people, you know, say, you know, touch bases on that again and let them know what the date, do you, you had a time, you want to say the time? I do, right? so, it is March 8th, here at Epic at 9.30, and there's a lot of performances, and I'll be performing some of my new songs off of my CD, and it's just going to be a lot of fun, free food, yeah, we're going to have a whole party here, cake, everything, first CD, got to do it. Okay, well, ladies and gentlemen, you know you heard it here. Man. You know, post the magazine, with lovely Kenzie. You know, post model. You know, she got next. If you can believe, you can achieve.